Welcome back to No Nonsense Reviews and How To's. Today I'm going to show you how to play Wii games larger than 4 gigabytes on your external hard drive. So you may have noticed that when you try and put games that are 5 gig, 7 gig, whatever it may be, on your external hard drive, you get an error message saying that the file's too big and it can't play the game. The reason that happens is because you had to format your external hard drive to FAT32 and FAT32 will only accept files that are under 4 gig. So I'm going to show you a workaround for that. Let's get started. So these three games here are all over 4 gig. Here's what happens if I try and copy and paste them onto my FAT32 formatted hard drive. Again, I get this error message. They're too large for the destination file system. Uh, each one is going to tell me it's too big. So this one's almost 7 gig. The this one here is uh, just over four and it's just it copied uh, empty folders here so I don't want these I'm gonna delete the empty folders and I'm gonna show you how to fix this so the first thing you want to do is go to this website which is in the description below and you're gonna want to download this Wii backup manager so just click on here and then scroll down to the download link and click on that uh, you have to wait a few seconds for this ad to finish and then hit skip. I just close this, it's another ad. Uh, for me it didn't work so I'm gonna click on the direct link button here and this may happen to you as well but as soon as you click on the direct link button it will automatically start downloading to your computer and there it is. So I'm just gonna show in folder and I'm gonna extract it right here. Once it's extracted, uh, choose which version that you need to use, either 64 or 32. I'm running a 64 system, so I'm just going to double click it and open it up. Here's the program, and now I just want to find those three game files that I told you about. So go to Add, Files, and wherever you have them on your computer. I have them in my Downloads folder under Wii Games. So open it up double click and do the same thing for the other two or however many games that you have you could do 10 15 20 doesn't matter how many games do as many as you need to so once you have them all double clicked check these boxes here to the left and now you want to tell it where you want to save it to so i'm going to select drive one here and then you have to tell it where drive one is. You can pick any of the drives on your computer. I'm just going to pick C. It'll tell you there's no WBFS folder. So yes, you should create one. Go back to your files. Go to transfer. Drive one, of course. That's where I said that my WBFS folder is. And it'll automatically start converting them. And I'll show you what they look like in just a second. So it's done. I can close the program now. And they're still over 4 gig, but when I go into the actual folder, they're split up now. So that one's 84 meg, and this is 3.99 gig. This here is 3.26 and 3.99, both under 4. 2.92, 3.99, again, both under 4. And when I transfer these over to my external hard drive they will transfer no problem and they also play on the Wii no problem so this is a very simple easy way to do it you can also use the Wii backup manager to convert Wii ISOs that's it thanks for watching